It's very angry. <laughs> oh no. I'm so sorry. All right, guys, it is about time we try and get ourselves a Diamantinosaurus. I am so keen to get one of these things. I've been wanting to for weeks and we've just haven't been the right level and stuff. So I'm I think I'm ready for it. Uh, I, I hope so. What do you think, Worm? You're kind of nodding. Yeah, yeah, you you're you're up for it. I think I'm up for it. <laughs> oh, dude, uh, we haven't had any trouble since last time in the base. I've, I haven't really done much, to be honest, either. I need to really get on some resource gathering, but I've just been so lazy. Just been making videos instead, not really spending the time outside of videos doing stuff that I should be doing. You know how it is. <laughs> oh, man. So, look, what do I have on me? I have 21 extraordinary kibble, two exceptional kibble. And I was just thinking about it. It might actually be good if we can use the Veninosaurus. Uh, or my rifle, because apparently what happens is this dude wakes up, and then you have to put him back to sleep. Uh, you know, that's pretty much it. Like, there's really not much to it. Um, so I'm kind of tempted just to grab some of that. Um, and can I just grab all of our narco berries? Which should be in here somewhere. Whereabouts are they? Um, I'm blind apparently. Narco berry. There we go. I'm just gonna grab all of those just to make sure we can make some more. Um, we can use my rifle if I have to. I've made plenty of darts now as well. Um, but I just need to try and use the tames that we've got as well, so... Yeah. Um, then I was thinking about it. I'm like, I should probably try and use the veggie cakes if we can. Uh, they will help us out a ton. And apart from that, I think it's good to go. So... I'm pretty heavy right now, so maybe we should try and use... The wyvern. Wherever it is. Thank you, wyvern. Um, I'm enjoying this base location. I'm so glad I moved here when I did. Like, you know, the whole thing we had going, like when we tried to come here and it went to crap, you know, that was all just part of the fun, right? <laughs> uh, like it was really bad. It really wasn't a good time, but I was, I could trade off. You know, I was okay with that. Oh, that's a Maywing right there. A little Maywing. Oh, no, no, no. Sorry. You looked really wide like you were one, but you're not. Um, okay. Anyway. So I was looking on the map before, I don't know where I saw them, but hang on, let me just bring this up again. So we got a 140 down here. Uh, I see a 145 here. So I think we're going to go for that one. And yeah, it's a male. I don't know if I'm going to get two of these dudes. I don't feel like doing any breeding on them. Um, but yeah, I hope this is going to be easy enough. I don't know what we're in for. <laughs> Um, should we go check that drop? I feel like we should. Oh, anyway, guys, if you do find yourselves enjoying this one and any incredible heartache we might come across the way, go ahead and hit that like button. It really does help me out. It also just tells me I've done something right and helps us sleep better at night. Plus, you could always consider subscribing, turning on notifications, leaving a comment down below. All of that's good stuff that helps me out a ton. And if you do want to go that step further, you can become a channel member. It gives you access to an exclusive video every Saturday night which is an additional ARC series at the moment, ARC Fantasy Ascended, which is on the Mr. Map, 50 plus mods, it's so much fun. Oh man, oh, this, this, uh, you know, Wyvern decided to come and try and fight me. It's good that we get the, ta the talons off of it, you know? I'd rather just bite it, by the way, it's just easier. I can get multiple hits in, it's so hard to use the lightning breath. And we just don't have the stam. You know, it's very annoying. So I'd rather just stay here and just keep biting this dude. Which is about to die now. There we go. Okay. Now, can I be bothered getting you? Oh, okay. I missed. Hang on. <laughs> I just don't want to bite everything else. Alright, there we go. We got it. I get those things out of it. I don't think they really do anything special either, but I got some XP. Oh, you've got a ring. Hell yeah. All right, nothing nasty is going to come out of the woodworks and destroy me. You know, Moro Rexes. <laughs> uh, hello? Did you just seriously disappear? Really? I kind of... Aw, man. Uh, okay. It is what it is. That's fine. All I wanted was that drop. Uh, also, there's a lot of Anzus around here. There's eggs, but I don't, I don't need any more of them. We've checked them out. Alright, moving on. 
so yeah, Spartal Farm's going great. I've just had a huge brush of energy to get stuff done on here, which, you know, has been very good. Um, I can't wait to get my next series started, which will be very, very soon. Uh, I'm looking forward to that a lot, actually. Um, another crazy modded series, like not like this type of modded. I'm talking more like uh, crazy stuff going on kind of modded. Uh, hello. Probably should try and kill all these when we have time. Um, also, I should take that out of there while we have a moment as well. All right, ready? Oh, you're going to hurt. You are going to hurt. All right, come here. Don't grab me, please. Uh, you could probably do that, can't you? Oh, can I be bothered fighting this thing? This thing's going to absolutely ruin me. Yeah, you know what? I'm worried it's going to grab me and just kill me in one hit or something. Let's just leave it. Everyone's probably disappointed. I know I could kill that thing. I know. It's just going to take ages, so I can't be bothered. All right? You caught me. You caught me being lazy. <laughs> oh, no. It's actually more time conscious than lazy. I just, you know, I've been I've been recording for a little while now, and I just want to take a bit of a... want to take it easy. That's all. Oh, man. Okay. Uh, it's just down here. So I actually think this is relatively easy, except for when it's not. Uh, that, that sounds very funny, I know, but yeah, I, I, you'll understand when we start doing this. So what I'm thinking about doing is I just want to take some time, clear out the area a little bit, make sure that nothing around is going to come and ruin our day. There is nasty things around everywhere all the time. But, you know, I reckon we can do this. It's really not that hard, I don't think. It's just maybe time-consuming. But, yeah, I want to make sure all the creatures around are dead. That are going to, like, you know, so nothing can ruin our day, essentially. Uh, are you actually down there? All right, can we just... I'll just keep going this way. I thought it was up here and I could clear a bit of a path to it. But maybe not. Okay, we're getting a lot of thatch too, by the way. I just, I did that on purpose. Just so you know, because I am very low on thatch right now. Okay. Um, I might start clearing out down there. Alternatively. Now, this doesn't hurt creatures, so I can do that next to him fine. Alright. Let's, let's clear all of this out. Give ourselves some visibility. Like, I just don't want one of those stupid, angry chicken things coming to kill us while I'm in the middle of trying to tame this thing. It just would be awful. Because, yeah, this thing's going to do some damage to us, I think. Um, we'll see, though. Hopefully it's easier than I'm making it out to be. Yeah, one of those things. See what I mean? There's already one here. All right, well, we're going to kill that. Oh, I just realized we got this when I killed that Kalen Kalenkin. Interesting, I didn't realize they were drop saddles, but apparently they do. That's pretty cool. Alright, well, unfortunately now the next problem is I I gathered too much stuff. Uh, I could probably drop the wood. We can get that with the Therry easy enough. I just want to keep the thatch. Which sounds completely backwards from what you would try and do normally. I know. Alright, uh, there's something over here. It's another one of those dudes. Can I get a hit on it? There we go. They're very angry. Very angry chickens, these ones. Alright. Have we cleared ourselves out for just a little sec? I think so. Alright, so next step is I need to switch out to... Uh, I, I want to leave the Venenosaurus out, actually. Um, just in case we have to put this guy back to sleep. Uh, you. Here we go. Alright, I want to ride you. I'll put that in there. Rugs, let's make some more Byronark. Okay. Oh, hang on, why is this the 130? Why am I tracking the 130? Oh my god, I'm an idiot. Wow. That one is up there. 
Oh, that was stupid. Oh my god. Alright, um... Can I just put you away? <laughs> Damn it. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna do this. I'm just gonna do this. Hopefully there's nothing there that's going to... ...be a problem? I already cleared all the humans out of here. No, there is already an Anzu, like, right next to it. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're gonna have to do the same thing. Maybe with the Wyvern again. Just so we have that height view that I really need right now. And also I can gather... Well, just break all of these super easy. Uh, we don't want to wake him up. I don't want to hit him. Alright. But I do want to kill this. Alright, let's wind your health down there, buddy. There we go. Alright, gotta break all these trees. I'm just gonna do the same thing again I just did. You don't have to see it. Okay, I think I've cleared out sufficient area now. I hope. What is that? That wasn't there a minute ago. Oh, I don't even know. That's very strange to me. Anyway, so essentially what we need to do... You are on passive, that's good. Um, we need to go up with, I think it's Exceptional Kibble. Uh, yeah, or Sweet Vegetable Cakes, actually, which is even better. I, because I did want to find a use for them, right? Um, and we've got to feed it. Now, there is a chance this thing will wake up between feeds. So, we need to be very careful. Uh, I don't know how long it takes between feeds, but it's really not that long from my understanding. Um, but we're going to have way more than enough stuff, because we've got so many veggie cakes. I've made kibble just sort of as a backup on that, so... Um, yeah, see what I mean though? It's really not that difficult, but it's when it wakes up, that's where we're in trouble. <laughs> this thing's got a lot of torpor, and we have to get it up to like 25%, I think, for it to go back to sleep. Uh, every time... It, get, it gets mad. We're doing well. That's three feeds, not mad yet. <laughs> oh, it isn't losing taming effectiveness as well, that's good. I was kind of a bit worried for a second <laughs> that it might. Um, yeah. Come on. Okay. Is that where it gets mad? Yeah, we woke it up. Okay. Not good. It's mad. Okay. Um, I want to force it back to sleep. It gets very angry when you wake it up. Um, hang on, is it C? Uh, is it X? Hang on, how do I do this again? Or, oh no, it's, it's just, it's just normal click. Okay. Oh, you hurt. Okay. How much torpor can I put on? <laughs> it's very angry. It's very angry. <laughs> oh no. I'm so sorry. Come on. Wrong side of the bed. Well, it's got 85 seconds. I don't know what that that buff does. If it does anything. Um, yeah, I feel like rifle's probably easier. Just to get it to go back to sleep. Also, we're not hurting it, which is good. Doesn't seem to be too mad at us. I don't know how much... How much we need to get it down. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Oh, ouchie. 600 damage. My god. Oh, insufficient stamina. I didn't know that would be a problem. Ouchie. I'm so sorry. Alright. Uh, well, this guy's not gonna work out, is it? Slowed and sleepy. I don't know what that does. Oh, that's because of my trank. Oh, I didn't realize that was a thing. That's very cool. We're about to run out of this stuff, though. I really should be, uh... Okay. You slowed again. Yeah, this has basically just helped us out with, like, one round. <laughs> Alright. We need to get away. We need to get away from this big angry giant. Um... All right, I'm so sorry. Have you chilled out? Okay. Um, I don't really know how we want to handle this now. Oh, hang on. Uh, I need to put those on. 
Now this should be a lot more effective. You know, in terms of torpor. I hope. Um, yeah, he needs to go back to sleep on his own, I think. Okay. Please go to sleep. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so, so very sorry. Oh no. Are you serious right now? Oh wait, tropicals, they don't they aren't mad, are they? I don't know if they are in this mod or not. I'm scared. Okay, we're almost at 25%, which I'm pretty sure is where you're supposed to get to. Okay, is that running? I can't even tell. Okay, is that going back to sleep now? Okay, what I might do is I might get the wyvern out just to be safe, because I really didn't like that. <laughs> uh, I'm also hearing things. Did that just wake up? Why did it wake up? Its torpor was completely down. Okay, I think it's chilled out now. All right, continuing to feed. Oh, we just crossed the 50% mark and it hasn't woken up yet. Fingers crossed. I think I remember seeing somewhere on the wiki. I need to double check if, um, if I'm correct about that. I think the higher the taming affinity goes, like the, f the longer you go, the, the more the percentage, like the, the chances of it waking up is less and less every, t like by certain thresholds. Like if you get over 50%, it's like, only X amount of percent chance it will wake up with a feed, whereas if it's a lower percentage, it's worse. I think? I could be completely making that up. I, I could be something else I've just confused it with, but I swear that's what I remember. <laughs> but uh, as you can see, we've uh, we've managed to get a lot further. Which is really good. Still not waking up, are you? Oh, that's really good. Alright, we might even be able to mostly just use veggie cakes too. This is awesome. Oh, come on, man. Really? <laughs> oh, it's mad. It's big mad. It's not happy. Yeah, 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 I know. I'm so sorry. Come on, that was like two more feet. <laughs> Bro. Calm down. I actually kind of want you to come this way, so that's kind of, uh... It's kind of good. Yeah, you follow me up here. So it's got this timer on that says wrong side of the bed, so I'm not sure if that's like it... It calms down after that time and goes back to sleep itself. I don't know. But then there was the advice that I saw that said like... If it doesn't go back to sleep on its own, put it to sleep with Tranks. So I don't know which one you have to do. Like maybe we can just wait? I, I don't know. Ooh, hang on. Hang on a sec. Are you actually going back to sleep on your own? Wait, we might have this. Do we have to wait for that timer though? I don't know, let's risk it. This is all for science. Are you still mad? Nope, you're not even mad anymore. Okay, I don't know what that timer is then. Maybe it's just like a buff instead of like a timer for it to end. But anyway, this should be like the last feed now. That's This is really not too bad, guys. Like, really not too bad at all. Okay, I'm glad I saved all these veggie cakes. Yes! We have you! You sleeping, gigantic, awesome beast. Let's, uh, let's wake you up. Let's get you to stand up here, buddy. Yeah, so I just wouldn't want to cry you while you were like that. Because that could be bad? I don't know. Alright, 145 turned into a 217. Let's put you away. Let's get on the wyvern, just so we're nice and protected. And what I want to know is... What stats you got there, bro? Where are you? There we go. Uh, nothing really that amazing. It's got decent weight, though. 
Actually, it's best stat is weight, which is probably good for what we want it for. Because I don't really want it for combat. I want it for, um, for gathering. So that's good. It's also got crap stamina. That's probably not good. Uh, it's got a lot of oxygen, which sucks. And it's, it's got a higher food than health or melee, which is also not good. So we didn't really get a great one. Um, okay. Good to know. Well, let's go back to base then. Um, wherever the hell base is nowadays. It's all the way down the other side of the map now. Um, we need to go check out its saddle. And then we need to try and actually use this thing. I'm very keen to try this thing. It's so cool. Okay, here we are. Now let's land here. So I need to test out the uh, deposit thing again as well. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. I always punch my freaking man. <laughs> oh, okay. Anyway. Uh, so I put this here now as well so I don't have to go out to the crane. But we need to figure out where some things go. Oh, that didn't go. Uh, okay. So keratin, that's because that's full. So we need it to go into the smithy. Uh, which is, yeah, there, I guess. There's an, I need to name them. It's the wrong one, but that's cool. Let's save those entries and go like that. And can I... I don't think I can make those go away. Uh, okay. Good to know. Let's put you back in the fridge. Put you back on my hotbar. And that can go in there. So can that. And the apex drops are in here. Like, I guess these probably just don't count, right? I guess. Oh, man, I can't believe we've got that. That's so cool. All right. Uh, I might just go put that away, actually. I need to freaking move where my blueprints are. I've got them in here. I couldn't use a bookshelf because for some reason you can put a storage box up here, but not a bookshelf because it doesn't have foundation, which is very frustrating. Uh, also, I keep doing that. Uh, is this thing made in a smithy? So if I was just to go, uh, by the way, this mod, um, uh, can I just, I'll just take a quick moment. This, uh, Diamantinosaurus mod, Aussie edition. So Aussie represent, <laughs> uh, I guess it's an Australian, uh, sauropod that was back in the day. If it is a sauropod, I could be wrong. Um, so yeah, it's, I'm pretty cool by, about that. Unless it's just made by someone who's Aussie, that could be a thing as well. Uh, but here we go. Diamantina. So, that's a helmet. So that's the chest piece. There's the platform saddle. Do we actually not have enough silica pearls? Is that what we're going to be short of? And also cementing paste? Ah, oh, man. Alright, well, I need to go quickly gather that stuff then. I'm just going to go do it and bring you back. There's no point in me showing you. Berserk Raptor Kill underway. I just spotted it. Ooh, cool stuff. Okay. That's kind of awesome. So much prime meat. Wow. All right. Just had to get the kills in. Couldn't help myself. I don't have any meat. All right. Back to base. Uh, I'll be able to get some meat while I'm there. Okay. We're good to go on this now, I think. So we need the saddle. So the platform saddle. Uh, and then we also, yeah, that's, I've got more cementing paste elsewhere. Don't worry. Um, so then we need, oh, it looks like this as well. Man, this is expensive. Uh, then we want that. And then we're going to want that as well. Uh, caravan leggings? Passively produce medical bruise. <laughs> Don't ask how it makes the bottles. Alright, good sense of humor. Uh, then I need to pull to make for that, because I can pull the cementing paste. Alright, I'm keen to see this, like, this saddle with all the different pieces. I love this. I love when saddles aren't just one big piece. They're, they've got sections to them that you can sort of tack on. Uh, I'm just, yeah, I'm very keen. <laughs> All right, let's go out here. Might just turn that off. We are very overburdened right now. Uh, well, not very overburdened, reasonably overburdened. But I want to come out here. We're going to have to find a safe space to do this as well. Like, I'm a bit worried about the Morrow Rex around. I don't really feel like losing this. But, you know, we can test it here, I'm sure. You are massive. Oh, my goodness. Okay. It, by the way, it's got a lot of health. <laughs> uh, so, we want the platform saddle. And then we want to put these on it as well. I don't know if we can... Can we see them now? Oh, you have to put the saddle on first and then you can see these. 
Gotcha. Okay. So, what do they even do? So, we've got the... Well, this is the saddle. So, it just allows you... It's, it's a platform saddle, so I can build a base on this if I want. Uh, the caravan chest piece, 50% weight reduction on everything. <laughs> oh, dude. Uh, and then, this also gives it an extra 25% weight reduction, so I think that means... 75% weight reduction, maybe? Or is it 25 and 50? It probably doesn't equal 75. It could be something different. I don't know. Uh, then it produces medical brews. And I don't really understand why, but let's not question it. Let's not question it. Anyway, here we are. Here is this awesome beast of a thing. Let's just quickly just get back here. We'll have a look at it. Yeah, you look really cool. I love the fact that it's got like all this cargo and stuff on it. That is just awesome to me. Okay. Anyway, so. How do we gather with you? So we just left click? Oh my god, we just got... Okay. Okay, this is going to be... How's your weight as well? Not great. Wow, okay. Not amazing. But... Oh, it also just spins in the place as well. That's kind of cool. Alright, well, everything's going into weight on you anyway. Okay. Let's just gather a few more things. So, we need to check out its other attacks as well. It's quite slow. Oh, that just got faster as we moved. Interesting. So, right click. I had a feeling would do this. Boom. Okay, that gathered a lot of different stuff. So, I'm thinking that this thing's natural weight reduction plus mine. Oh, see? Is a raw? X? I don't know what that does. Control? Nothing. Okay. Well, we need to get closer to the trees by the looks of it. Can I break any of these, please? Okay. Oh, I think the attacks are directional as well. I could be wrong about that. But, you know, I think if we get this thing in the right spot, we're going to gather so quickly. You know, like, maybe we can take it out across the bridge kind of thing. And just go and gather a heap of crap. Like, I don't know. The fact that we can gather everything, though. Like, we can gather stone at the same time. We can gather wood. We can gather fiber. Metal, by the looks, as well. You know, this is, this is pretty awesome. I am big fan of what we've got going on here. Um... You know, it's, it could be a little bit more efficient at it. It's probably the only critique I have. But if I just stand this near the crane, and I just do a deposit, like we could always just have another crane over near the front, right? Okay. Lucky I've got my little quick unload. Uh, then can I distribute? I kind of get into the inventory. Oh, it's doing that thing. For some reason... Things lock up for me all the time, and I don't really understand why. I don't know if that happens to anyone else, but... Yeah. Anyway, doesn't matter. Uh, what I was hoping is, can I put you away? And do you drop the rest of your saddle? Uh, you drop your caravan leggings, which is what? Just the medical brew thing? Okay. Well, at least you keep most of it. I kind of want to go and fight that thing over there. So we're going to go do that. I don't know if this is a good idea or not. As long as we don't end up fighting an Indom, I, that's the only thing I'm afraid of right now. Because this thing is actually pretty powerful. We need to test it on something, so... Might as well be this, hey? Alright, where are you? Gigantic beast. Alright, you kept all of the other pieces, right? No, you didn't. Wait, what? Oh, they disappeared. Oh, man. All right, whatever. We'll, uh, we'll have to go make some more. That sucks. All right, so the, the reality is be careful with this dude. Now, how much damage do we do? 200. Wow. What about this? <laughs> oh, yeah. 1500. What does that do? Is this a fear roar? Nah, I think it's just a roar. Okay. Well, I reckon we can kill this thing super quick then. Yeah, this thing's powerful. Alright. Gotcha. And you can gather. 
Nice. Alright, unfortunately it's incredibly slow. It's almost like I'm not even sprinting, but I am. Interesting. Alright, well I guess I'll just try and, what, gather for a little bit? Gotta try and replenish some of the resources that we've just, um... Lost. <laughs> oh man. But look though, like we've already managed to get... Tons of wood. Look at that. And its weight's really not that, you know, greatly affected right now. Which we've got 3,000 of now. Yeah, no, this guy's gonna be good, I think. So yeah, I'll gather a little bit of stuff. Oh yeah, we need to test out. Does this, does this thing actually get faster? I think it did. I think it just took a, like a little bit to, um... Like, I think it was just like, building up? Maybe? Okay. Good to know. Somehow I feel that this bridge is not built for this creature. <laughs> oh, that's ridiculous. Okay. Um, the only painful thing now would be trying to figure out how to get the goods back into the... Wait, you can climb the wall? No way. You can actually just climb the wall. You are that big. Okay. I mean, I'm not going to question that. That, that works out very well for us. <laughs> Oh, dude. Well, this is what we got so far. Um, that took a little while to get. Probably a little bit more than I'd like it to be, but... You know, in saying that... I don't care right now. Ah, uh, see, I can't... Yeah. Can I get you closer? What's what I just hear? Was that a Berserk Raptor down there? Okay, interesting. So, quick unload. Okay, and then distribute. Right? Some things cannot be distributed. Okay, well, I can't get in there, so... That sucks. Uh, we need your saddle back. Interestingly enough, we... Uh, do we even have the stuff? We need to be more careful, I guess. Okay, so we've got that, we've got that. It's this. And that we need. Yeah, we could do it. Caravan chest piece. So we managed to get a whole lot of stuff even without a weight reduction because I've got the 90% stack mod, so... You know, I think I'm just gonna put this back on and... I think I'm okay with what we've got so far. I'm very happy. Very happy with that guy. Um, I gotta figure out how I wanna use it, so I probably obviously have to take its saddle off before I relocate it, but I could just take it up somewhere, use it to smash things apart, and then bring it back down, maybe? I don't know. Oh, I don't know why I did that. Anyway. You know what we will do? We're going to leave that there, and we're going to go over and get this red drop, because that's just sitting over there calling my name. Uh, Wyvern, come here. Protect me. Are we going to be able to get this drop? Are we going to be able to get it? Or is there going to be something over here? Trying to take it away from me, like a, another Rex? <laughs> I'm forever gonna feel butthurt about that, okay? Uh, what do we got? Ah, oh, you Tyrannus Saddle? Not mind, don't mind if I do? Good stuff. Okay, let's get you back over here then. And we're gonna end off, I think. Yeah, that's gonna be it. Okay, let me just park. Yeah, that's totally a Berserk Raptor down there. I should totally kill that thing, but... I can't be bothered right now. I just freaking killed another one. You know, I don't have to kill everything, right? Okay, let me just go through here. Just gonna close that. Anyway, guys, uh, let me know what you think about this guy. I mean, are you all ex as excited about it as I am? Because I think it's really cool. And uh, let me just turn around here. I think it's gonna be very useful for gathering from here on out. You know, providing we don't have any big problems with said gathering. I hope not. But yeah, it very much makes me happy, this thing. is. Look at his nose. What the hell is that? <laughs> you look like you've like got a big cold or something, like you need to sneeze, you know? Very strange looking. Anyway, guys, if you did find yourselves enjoying this one at any point in time, I really would appreciate if you can go ahead and hit that like button. It really does help me out. It also just tells me I've done something right and helps us sleep better at night. Plus, you could always consider subscribing, turning on notifications, leaving a comment down below. 
All of that's good stuff that helps me out a ton. And if you do want to go that step further, you can become a channel member. It's $1.50 a month and gives you access to an exclusive video every Saturday night. Which at the moment is Ark Fantasy Ascended on the Emissa map. So much fun. Go check it out. Um, anyway guys, as always, I hope you all enjoy whatever it is you're doing, whatever time zone it is. And I'll be seeing you in the next one. Bye bye for now.